I'm Paul McGinley, I'm 52 years of age now. Um, I've transitioned from being a, a full-time professional golfer into being a, a part-time professional golfer where uh, I play a, a reduced schedule, but starting to spend more time in the public eye. Um, leadership speaking, uh, ambassadorial work, representing different companies, as well as some TV work. Around the age of 44, 45, I started to realize uh, that I was starting to lose my hair on the front and, and my haircut was getting shorter and shorter as a result. Uh, and after several discussions with friends of mine and people in the business and other sports people who have had uh, hair transplants done, uh, I f uh, figured, you know what, I should go and at least find out what it's all about. Um, I did a lot of research and uh, the name that kept cropping up was Dr. Collins and the HRBR clinic. Being Irish, I certainly wanted to get something, any, any operations I've had done on my, on my body and on my legs and stuff has always been done in Ireland and uh, this was perfect. Uh, that was an Irish guy who was uh, regarded around the world as, as being the best at what he does. And uh, I came and listened to what he had to say. He explained what needed to be done in my hair and how he would go about it. And uh, we got a date in the diary and off we went. When I came in for the day of the procedure, um, I was quite taken aback actually by how big a team were involved in the whole process. It's a real team effort, uh, a lot of expertise, incredible professionalism uh, at every level. There's the sandwich and the soup was superb. I mean, every, everything, I, I, it, was, it was a really professional outfit and I can see why you know, HLBR regarded so highly throughout the world and from why people come from all over the world to, uh, to get the work done here in Dublin. It was explained to me very clearly that uh, it would take you know, six months to a year uh, before I'd start to see some, some results coming through. Um, and that's exactly what happened, you know, it was a slow process. Then it was a question of going back to the guy who cuts my hair, who's a good friend of mine, and he was one of the guys that had pushed me to get it done. Uh, and it was great for him because now he could be a lot more creative in how he cut my hair. Uh, he was thrilled about it, he's had it done himself. And uh, off we went with uh, a different style of hair. If there was one thing I would have done different, I would have got it done at a younger age when I started to lose my hair. I, I know the importance of how you look and, and you know projecting a good image. And if you have an opportunity to have a fuller head of hair, um, why not take it? I'm really thrilled that I've made that decision and uh, here I am.